just a little more to fill up the mobile weather watcher, but I think it's worth it. Time to head on out to Cumberland, Wisconsin. It's the only Wisconsin stop on this summer's going to the lake road trip. Frank Vassalero and Amelia Santanello made the less than two hour drive this morning to Cumberland. Yes, and Amelia, I hear you like the area so much. Sources have told us that you are uh, talking to realtors in the area. Is that true? <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to stop and look at the real estate, yes. Yeah. So I just want to see how much uh, cabins run. Maybe we can rent. I don't know. Rent yeah. an apartment. Amelia right. loved it. She said, she looked at the place, she goes, we should move here. Yes, uh -huh. <laughs> exactly. Retire here. We're, we're right along the shores of Beaver Dam Lake. As things are quieting down a little bit, but there's still people out here on jet skis, a boat, paddle boarding around. And, you know, we have found some great places to visit on these trips. And a lot of that is because of emails from viewers who really know and love these towns. Yeah, and we received no more recommendations for any trip than we did for this place. It's called Louis Finer Meats. And I'll tell you, we took your recommendations and went by there, and we were thrilled that we made the stop. Louis Minch has been winning awards for his meat creations for 40 years. I made uh, Kato Salami. He won the trophy he's holding today back in 1975 with a little help from his dad, Louis. We went to a, a bar and we had a beer and he wrote the recipe down on the back of a matchbook and that was that was where it started. Dad is retired from the Wisconsin staple he started, but he still keeps a watchful eye. I went fishing with him this week and he tells me all the time how proud he is of the success and all the hard work that we've done. That success came from trying something new. Early on, the Minches created their own recipes for everything and never skimped on quality. The result, a must-stop destination on the way to the cabin. And oh, yeah, more than 100 different kinds of brats. We started really thinking outside of the box. We didn't stoop to the gummy bear brat yet, but we have, we have had the, uh, uh, we have all the different teams. We got to keep our Minnesota friends happy with the Viking brats and twins brats. So what's in a Viking's brat? I didn't say choke cherries. No. <laughs> Ouch. No choke cherries, purple cabbage and mozzarella instead. We smoke them for about uh, four hours. Everything is made right here. You can buy it fresh or get it frozen to enjoy later. He said use this rub. So well, let me give you a couple ideas over okay. here. If you have a question about how to season or cook your meat, Louis rib rub. Louis and his staff are always ready to help. You make going to the cabin pretty much uh, <laughs> the best part about it because our meals are always awesome. Got a whole box of meat here, so appreciate it. I know there's something about you that I like. <laughs> Thank you for Thanks stopping. So, yeah. Just a yeah. spectacular story. It's almost overwhelming because there's so many flavors of the brat and the sausages and then all those seasonings that they put together. Uh, they had a new one that I liked. I think it was the jalapeno cheddar beef stick, which Jala was great. The jalapeno cheddar brat, too. That was, was excellent, wonderful. too. Italian sausage. And I just met Louie's wife in between our oh, five thirds. Yeah, that's so she nice. was lovely. Uh, they employ uh, 42 people here, so really a fabric of community. And man, give them a call ahead of time. They'll have everything waiting for you. But really stop in and enjoy the journey because it is a fantastic place. Place to shop. Yeah, it is. So there are a lot of fantastic places here at Cumberland, but we're going to go yeah. off because we have to go and fish now. On the way, right behind us. Yes. In separate boats? In the same With boat. separate <laughs> boats. No, unfortunately, no. together. But that's together. kind of the fun and charm of it. That'll be romantic. Unfortunately, I can't wait to see it. It's going to be lovely. We'll look Thank for you guys you. at 10. Thanks, guys.